In this video I'm going to show you how you can turn your digital photographs into realistic paintings using a program called Dynamic Auto Painter. Now this program isn't free unfortunately, but it's well worth the money. The current price is, let me just check, the current price in um, British pounds is £62.15, so you know it's, it's not cheap, but in my opinion it's well worth the money, so it's basically a program which turns your um, digital photographs into realistic paintings. There's just some samples you can see here on the website. It's kind of all different kind of um, settings. You can have Van Gogh kind of style paintings. So anyway, that, that's the um, program. Um, the current version is version 5, but I'm sure version 6 will be out anytime soon, or even version 7, depending on when you're watching this video. So let's just give you an example of how, of how easy it is to use. So this is the program. It's got kind of a kind of basic interface on the left hand side here. You can see all the kind of different settings, there's different painting styles you can choose from. I'll just give you a little example. I mean you've got all different ones you can select. One of my personal favorites is called Glamour. I'll show the a demonstration of that in a minute. Um, you've got Golden Age. You have pastels, you have um Vincent, Pop Art, there's all kinds of different ones, you know, and you've got some Van Gogh down here. So, I mean, once you hover over them, it gives you a little um, preview of what your picture, the kind of style that your, your digital picture will be painted at. So, anyway, so to start the program, all you have to do is click on this little folder icon, you choose any kind of um, digital picture from your PC. So, if I just take a so for this, I got it's a picture I took taken of a water vol. So, so this is the original picture. So if I want to choose a, a painting style, one of my favourites is glamour and version ultra detail. So all I have to do is, is essentially select that and click start. There are other options down here, such as painter, which allows you to um, a few different settings. Allows you to choose the time it takes to paint the um, to um, process the image the speed and stuff like that, the, the detail and all that kind of thing, so you can choose all of them, there's all other options as well you can use after you've um, processed the image, so if I just give you a quick demonstration, this does um, take a little bit of time to kind of process, it depends on the power of your PC generally speaking p pictures kind of take around between 30 seconds and up to 5 minutes depending on the actual style you choose this one's quite quick, I'm using a, a uh, an Intel 5 processor for this, so it works pretty well. So we're uh, nearly complete, it's taken around 30 seconds so far. Just give a little, a few more seconds and it should be completed. So now it's just about finished so you can now see a complete different transformation that this is the ultra detail um, glamour effect so look, look at that, that's, that's an amazing kind of difference I'll show the original picture here, you can click view and select input image, so there's the original and there's there's the finished um, product the, the finished painting is produced, I mean that's a massive difference, look at that original and the finished painting. So that's an amazing effect. Imagine you can print that out, have that in a picture frame, that'll, that'll look amazing. That's the kind of kind of stuff you expect to buy on expensive websites, you know. So there's a little example. I'll choose another photo just to just give you another example. Um let's choose uh let's choose a horse in a field. So again I choose I just show you again the glamour ultra detail which is my favourite. I'll just try this one. Like I say, this program is really simple to use. You don't have to fiddle around with any kind of complicated um, settings. You can just choose your painting style and click start and the process will take care of itself. You can, of course, adjust the um, painting afterwards if you want to.
So now the um, painting has finished processing and you can see that looks even better than the first one. I don't look at all the detail you can see there, all the, the long grass and the flowers and the horse kind of buried in the background. So again, I'll just show you the, the original. That's the original and that's the finished painting. So such a huge difference. I mean, I, I love this particular effect, the, the Glamour Ultra HD comes out amazingly. Looks, every, everything looks kind of rich and glossy. So I'll just show you another demonstration. I'll choose another photo. Let's choose um, let's choose this. There's a house on the on the edge of the coast, so I choose another one, which one I think is this one. Yeah, this one I like. So I choose this set then. This kind of gives like a realistic painting effect. This one takes a couple of minutes to process, so you know, every kind of um different setting takes a certain amount of time some kind of process within 30 seconds others take up to five minutes which is kind of a little bit of annoying but it depends on the speed of your PC so you can see this one's taken a lot longer than the, uh, the the first one I did I think this one takes approximately two to three minutes you can see it's kind of giving you a a demonstration of it being painted which is pretty cool okay it's now finished processing that painting as you now can see I will show you the original that's the original of uh, the house overlooking the sea and this is the process painting version so you can see that's a massive difference that looks like somebody has painted that with a, a brush and you know and some water paint that that looks really realistic if you showed that to somebody you would think that was a painting. You would you wouldn't guess that was a digital photograph taken on on the coast, you know, in your local town. So, you know, that's just a, a little example of what this program can do. Like I said, there's there's about 50 plus different painting styles, plus different variations of each kind of painting kind of style you can have. So, there's absolutely loads, and you can also um, I, I believe you can download some additional ones from the website as well, which you know. You can probably have over a hundred different painting styles. I mean, there's absolutely loads to choose from, kind of ones to suit every kind of style. Style. So, I mean, that's just an example. You also have all these different settings in the bottom, which generally, unless you're kind of, you know, a professional, you don't really kind of need all these. Just in most cases, to select your picture, click the start button, and it will produce a kind of stunning kind of painting effect. You can also choose outline the canvas you can choose the different ca canvas background the material as well you can adjust the colors you can add layers and most of all the final output allows you to kind of save so all you have to do is click save as save it to your computer you can then view it on your computer or you can you know save it to a usb stick whatever so that's how you use it it's, it's a great free program called i'm not it's not free sorry it's a great program called Dy dynamic auto painter it's just over £60. I highly recommend it if you want to turn your digital photographs into um, paintings. So that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.